Hey everyone, welcome to the Horror Show Podcast. I'm Cecil Laird. <laughs> podcast, honey and fuego. <laughs> Do you see Bob Slaughter Podcast? Luis Hernandez. Podcast. podcast. Yeah. yeah. Podcast. Marsha Parker on a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we are back to do some podcasting. We haven't Finally. done a specific podcast in a while, but we have reason to, so here we are. We've been trying, I mean, we've done so much recently between the Phoenix Film Festival and all the other crap, and we're literally wow. three days away from driving out to Texas Frightmare. Yeah. We're doing two 18-hour drives to cover that just for you guys. <laughs> oh, God. There will be podcasting as a result of that, don't worry. The and we will deep. be recording some <laughs> some vlogging along the way. I'm going to be stuck for 18 deep. hours in a vehicle with three stinking men. I'm going to fart the It's actually only you. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because Dave, Dave. Dave can't. No, Dave's not going. Dave's, oh, Dave's canceled. not going. Dave, no, apparently... Dave the, next, I, uh, the next time I asked about it, he's like, I don't remember saying I'd go. He's like, I can't go. He did not remember drunkenly saying, yeah, I'm going to go. No. Nope. Drinking whiskey. No. <laughs> no. Nope. Nope. He bailed out. Really? Yeah. That doesn't surprise me. So you just me. have this floating no, ticket. I, well, that's my buddy James is going to use it on Friday. Yeah. But otherwise, yes, we have, you know, a, a, a floating ticket for Saturday and Sunday. For somebody who will be in the area. area. <laughs> well, I might know someone who'd want to go. Okay. Well, we'll have a ticket for Saturday oh, and Sunday. Oh, I have to is work. Is he a Western Evil guy? And then uh, well, Sunday at the most, because I'm not sure. I think we yeah. might, he might be going Saturday, so it might be Friday and Sunday. I'm going to meet at the end of the month. Okay. So. Okay. okay. Good to All right. Anyway. So, <laughs> we're sidetrack. Well, scene. that's what podcasts. Wait, is this live? No. Okay. Does yes. It is live. I was like, wait. Is this real? What's wrong with you? Is this real live? All right. So here we <laughs> go, guys. What we're here to talk about this podcast is we are going to be once again participating in the 2019 Phoenix Fan Fusion, previously known as... Phoenix Fan Fest, previously, previously known yeah, as the Phoenix, Phoenix Comic Con. In all, all in one weekend, mind you, this changed. Literally. Like Every Fan single Fest day. Uh, well, no, because Fan Con. Fest was the West Side one. What was the one last year? It was... It was no, 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 they all changed. It was, no, it was Phoenix weekend. Comic Fest last year. Yeah, yeah it was Comic right. Fest. It was Phoenix yeah, Comic yeah, Fest last but year. But it all changed. Just... made more so sense. So it is Phoenix Fan Fusion, previously known as Phoenix Comic Fest, previously known as Phoenix Fan Fest, previously known as Phoenix Comic Con. Fan Fest was the spin-off. So, the son of Comic Con. It yeah. all changed in one weekend. Yeah, that's right. Because last year, people didn't know about that Phoenix Comic Con had actually changed its name mm -hmm. to Phoenix so, Comic Fest. To Phoenix yeah. Com Comic, Comic Fest. Fest and that's so a lot the of people Comic didn't Fest. even go, and they were very upset. But then every day, then it became to it came to the well. That that's one reason they were upset. The other reason is Saturday or fr what was it? Friday or Saturday? Saturday. That, that there was cemetery a, panel got canceled. Yeah, there was a, there was a fire alarm pulled, right. and Streets. they didn't let anyone back yeah. in. But but also that guy who's crazy who guns. tried to oh yeah, yeah the guy yeah. brought the gun. No, that's too. Like, that was oh no, that was, right. that was the previous no, year. That was the previous year. No, I'm pretty sure. No, that no, was no it was the previous. Year. Year. No, it was the previous. Marshall's right. It was the previous year. Two years ago, he was going to kill the green. Yeah, because the Green Ranger came back last year after the fact. Oh yeah. Okay, but. Something happened. So lot. literally, but something happened <laughs> literally every single day because they changed the name mm -hmm. every single day. Well, not day. because of that, but it didn't help. Uh, so this year it is Phoenix it. Fan Fusion, guys. That's, that's a really a roundabout way for us to say that. Yeah. And that's In what case what you <laughs> didn't know, it is Phoenix Comic Con, but AKA. You can't say Phoenix, Phoenix Comic Con. Well, so you guess, don't miss out on it. You can't say Phoenix Comic Con. It's because San Diego Comic Con is it, suing okay. everyone that calls themselves Comic Con. Although, like, Lou and I were talking about New York is still saying New York yeah. Comic Con. Don't they are going... They're, they're going like, head to head. Uh, yes, they, they are. are. Yo, don't fuck New York. Don't fuck New York. Don't fuck New York. Yo, bro. Someone who is at New York Comic Con? No. You don't. No, that is... They... Are you kidding? They had the big... I remember I went out there when the new Batman was coming out. Batman. 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 With Batman. Ben Affleck. The new Batman. And they had yes. unveiled the statue. Oh, yeah. And mm. I was there for it. Man, you don't fuck with the Batu. The Batu. The Batu. <laughs> the Batu. <laughs> Everything. Like, no. It was, is it real? With the Batu. It's real. Is it the like, only thing that was can I go visit it? I don't know if it's still there. But oh. anyway. Um, yeah, so that's it. The only thing really? that was different about the New York Comic Con that I noticed is that there weren't a, that many people dressed up. And I had Less asked my friend price. Rolo, who does a lot of our artwork on the channel. Shout out. I asked him why that Ooh, is. He's shit. like, think about it. It's New York. We used, we're used to seeing this stuff all the time. Like movies yeah. and all that all yeah, the time. But, so people, they're used to that kind of stuff every day. So when they go to the, like, the Comic-Con, they don't dress up as much. 
So out San here, Diego, though, I mean, being so close to, the, I mean, just an hour, hour and a half away from LA, right? I mean, they dress up cosplay like yeah, crazy. Yeah, LA. Out there. Yeah, I mean, that's well, what they LA do. But it's showy, showy. Yeah, mm. New York. They don't give no fucks. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's tons of cosplay in New York, though. There are no. There's fucks not. There's not given. a lot. But the ones that are out there, they are good. They well, are really, well, really the fucking good. Well, it's the pro cosplayers who are going out there trying to get attention. I no, there's a lot of cosplayers in New York, guys. Bro, I, okay, I'm not saying, but I'm saying... At Bro, the look at some freaking New York Comic Con cosplay slideshows. I was there! I was there! You and Vietnam? I was okay. there! All right, well, we're way... We're, we're not even <laughs> into our topic we're not even yet. talking about it, but that's a horror show podcast, right? So, guys, yeah, we're My here to talk about hurt. what we are going to be doing in 2000. And Oof. 19 <laughs> Phoenix Fan Fusion. <laughs> oh boy. Um, we all right. Three this year. We, we have are scaled gonna... back. Oh god. <laughs> I don't, I've got the hiccups. You're good. So we are going to be doing three panel. Oof. This year. <laughs> we have, Damn it. We have scaled back the amount of panels <laughs> well, because one particular year. Two, two years two, ago. Two years, two years ago, ago we did eight. Seven eight. Or no, eight. we did eight. Well, was it eight? We did yeah, eight yeah, yeah. in one year. We did eight panels and then last year we did five we did five last year and we've and scaled, scaled back, to back to three because we just realized because that's all you need to get past I mean, <laughs> but, but, it's, it's that's not even well, quite say frankly that. the reason why is because after having done that year that year of eight podcasts we literally got a form email saying thank you for your contributions to phoenix comic-con this year and it's like Man, we provided eight different hours, and you couldn't have sent one, like, actual personalized email. Hey, thank you, Horror Show, for pre- providing eight hours of content I think it's so for our freaking right convention. Yeah, yeah, you just got the auto, uh, the not, auto email, it's, it's, then. It's, it frustrated me. So we went down to five last year, and I'm like, why are we even busting our hump for five? Three well, is all we need to get passes for saying, the full like, event. We have three really good solid Three really good panels, panels and I that's did all we think, need. I did think it was... Um, I thought it was an honor that they asked us to do a couple specific ones. I thought that was great mm-hmm. that we were actually asked to do specific ones. It was, that was it last year. Oh, right? last year, yeah. Yeah, yeah. last year they asked had us such... to cover particular topics. Yeah, they were like, we have all these panels. Could you do any of them? And I'm like, I guess we could do I these. just thought it was it was cool to be asked to do that. Like, there was the first time somebody actually like, sought us out to true. do yeah. that. So well, I think... My- well, I would like to say thank you for thinking of us. No, I agree. And this is technically the fourth year we've been doing panels for them. Marsha, if yeah. I recall correctly, this is the fourth year oh, we've done panels. No, this is this is, uh, is five or six at least. This I is don't five. Think it's, I, I well, really don't Phoenix think Definitely so. f- Phoenix Comic Con. Well, no, well, we've been show, going since 2014. We started been there. panels in 2015. That. So, yeah, this is at least year five. Oh, God. I remember the first year we went. We did do it the first year. Yeah, it was 16. No, the first year was 14. 16, 17, And the first year we did do a panel. They asked. All right, maybe the last four. You might be right. Yeah, yeah. 16, 17, 18. We just had a booth the first year we went, and that's how we got That's right, and that was in 15 that we had to do. All right. I remember, all I know is that I remember the first year when we went out in to Phoenix Comic Con and doing all the panels and doing all the interviews. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so pissed off. I can't believe I got these hiccups and I can't get it under control during so a fucking much. podcast. No, you'll be okay. It makes you'll me so angry. Vinegar. Vinegar does it every time. Hold your breath for a minute. Oh, wait, no. Doesn't mean they have uh, to see the agree? video version of this. Swallow, hold your breath. <laughs> and swallow. That's and what I've heard. That's what he says. It never works. And keep swallowing until you can't swallow anymore, and then you breathe out. And then you hey, swallow more. Hey, that's a musician's <laughs> like tip if you have the hiccups. Okay. No. Swallow. You like swallow. look up and small swallow. And you keep doing. You don't breathe out, but you keep doing it. Sonic and keep doing it. My bone. Air bubbles. Yeah. So yeah, we have three of them this year. Though. Anyway, I, mean, I, I literally tried to grab my phone so I could read what the panels are. But so we got I cry. Didn't grab my phone because I'm a fucking idiot. So so maybe oh, what, something. What are some of the favorite oh, it's in my panels? Pop. That, <laughs> okay, I was trying to I was trying to improvise there for a second. No, I, was no, I have like, the actual <laughs> panel descriptions. <laughs> well, so. well, well, I was gonna ask like what were some of the favorite panels that we've participated in previously? Ones that like stick out to all of you. Uh, the. Television ones. I'm just gonna do the ones I did. Television, 
Mm-hmm. Uh, creature feature. I've seen that. American okay. Horror Story. Yeah, the American Horror Story, I still think that in the first Supernatural panel that we did. Oh, that first 11, Supernatural panel was amazing. Th- like, those were some of my absolute favorite memories. Uh, in Mine was American Horror Story, that <coughs> first one we the did. First, that was a, the, dude, they were, you were on like, that. Yeah, they were, that's the only one you guys did, though. They were sending people. <laughs> you said it's the first one. They were one sending going. people away, the remember? <laughs> because it was against fire yeah, laws for them to <laughs> actually be in, and, and that was the Roanoke season, and Roanoke. Yeah. Was great. And oh, that was, it was the so last good. great season of that show that they've had, mm-hmm. from what a lot of people have said. Uh, um, yeah, it's two two seasons ago now. What? Mm. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyway, mm-hmm. there's a reason um, why he's Susie, not. Susie, a favorite anymore. panel that you've been a part of? Um, Something that comes to mind? The one that I was upon it. Uh, well, there's a couple of them. Unfortunately, um, you know, having children, it really. I don't think I was actually mm-hmm. able to make it last year. Um, but the ones that I was a part of, the ones I really, really enjoyed, which are actually like the great debate that mm-hmm. we did. Mm-hmm. And it was just because of the audience interaction and how fired up everyone got. And I loved seeing that. Because even after we had, we had prizes, big room too. <laughs> we had prizes to give away and we didn't have anything else to give away, but people still wanted to debate. Yeah. And that was so great. Just and I think that it. that's Power what was Nerdum. exactly. I think that that was the most beautiful sign of everyone coming together and they love a genre and they are just all about it. There's definitely nothing more beautiful than people coming together. It was like right there and I was all like the whole show. <laughs> They don't. They can't see what I'm so doing. So I've got the I just actual. Realized with us like setting our drinks up and down, it's gonna be just like with my review where it's not gonna be that bad. Ringing. It's well, when the phone no, no, no. The, the phone goes. electronically fucks with. It. Susie, That's move your weird. phone off the table, yeah. please. It just came Why? to mind because on. I remembered you telling me about that. Okay, if as, long, as long as it's not on, that's fine. <laughs> so what are the yeah, panels no. you guys are doing this year? So that's we have three. We eventually getting. <laughs> <laughs> we have three. That's what I'm trying to pull up and. <laughs> Phoenix. One's about crying. Thank you, Louise. I really appreciate <laughs> yeah, that. It's like, I'm trying to navigate this back towards the actual really and the discussion. But the discussion. Will get me out of the rest on home. <laughs> well, I don't know why. It happens to the best of these. Oh, oh I got to pull up the email. That's there's why. Only okay. three, though, right? Yeah. Yes, there's only three. This yeah, time. we already talked about that. Yeah. Yeah. So one is remakes, right? Yep, on, uh, on uh, Sunday. You had the printout over there, right? That's thank you. That's that's Fuego producing right there. All right, like I'm only finger. a co-producer. So what we have <laughs> is well, no, but I had the the actual dates and times here. So let me uh, oh. let me get that All right. pulled up. We can talk about um, well the first. What one, are you I excited mean, can, about this year though? Um, as far as who's gonna be there? I am like excited for and stuff like that. Yeah. Billy D. Williams, he's gonna be in episode he's nine this December, there. and I cannot wait. Jeff to see Goldblum Lando is gonna Lyle. be there. I'm so excited. Whoa! Yeah. That escalated real quick. Are you getting Are you getting a photo off? Because yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll contribute if I can. Oh, yeah. I will contribute. Yeah. To that. that will be the to first who? time oh. out of four years. Just no, I'm just kidding. Oh my god! I'll uh, contribute. Uh, to that. I think we. Uh, yeah. Uh, I think we all. Uh, I think we all need to be in it. We all need to be. I want to. <laughs> I want to dress up like Raptor and take a picture. No, yeah, so we, we definitely really? need to do Raptor? that. So. Yeah, okay, uh, so we got the dates and times. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> no, I know. Why would Jeff go blow? So, guys, here are our part. three panels that we're doing. It's the thing. You ready? Yeah, we're waiting for you, bro. No, I know. Talking. So, panel number one yes. is going to be Friday. That okay. is 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. in room 226A, if you are going to be nearby. So stay up late for our This panel. one is called, I'm Not Crying, You're Crying. I'm Not yeah. Crying, oh, yeah. You're Crying. And uh, the description of this panel is as follows. Sure, horror movies are meant to scare and unnerve you. Sure. But did you know that they can make you ball, too? Join Arizona Zone, the, the horror show channel, as they dive deep into the numerous examples of balls. horror movies that can cut through audience exteriors and punch them right in their feels. Balls. I right to your balls. <laughs> That's a good description. Right in the it's feels. Really Thank good. you. It's very good. Thank it's you. Really good. good job, Cecil. One? Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. I did. I did. Air high five. Now, Fuego wrote the Stephen King one, but I wrote the other two. Okay. Um, well, yeah, the remakes one isn't nearly as good, but yeah, that was a good one. Mm-hmm. Well, so really let's hard. let's stick with that for a minute, okay? okay. So, so <laughs> I got my three. Who all is on that one? 
<laughs> it's okay. So that one, Marsha's gonna be there, uh-huh. right? Marsha, you said you'll be there. In yeah, I'm there, and I have my three already. But that's Sunday. No, no that, that's not. Friday. You like just said it was Friday. Oh no, I'm sorry. I got it backwards. Yeah, I got it, I, wrote, I had it reversed yeah, on my thing. Yeah, I wrote here, so. it down. No, you're on that one. Okay. So, all right. So Marsha's three. Go ahead, Marsha. What is your three? Okay. Wait, are we saying our three? I haven't picked my three. Well, <laughs> well, we, you we didn't have to. Prepare. We have to. Yes, yeah, that's part you of what. Prepare. That's part of what we have to do. We never Wait, said go. we were. I, yes, I said we okay, were planning we our panel. So it's okay. Uh, you can you can come up with it while we're talking or later. It's okay. You don't have, just you we're gonna just call think, ours, so you're gonna you be can limited. Just think of stuff while while we're doing. <laughs> well, look, I did I did I did a I did a thread in Killer Flicks that had a bunch of options. I thought we were gonna wait to reveal it mysteriously, like at the. Why would well, no, we ever do we, that? We've never done that. We talked about this. Okay, yeah, sorry, sir. Yeah, but we just we save the podcast and release it immediately after the convention is uh, what we do. Okay, well, that's clarification then. All right. <laughs> I thought we were supposed to put this up before. because How am I supposed to make the slide no, the presentation if not. I don't know what The preview what is what we're going to record over there. Hi, oh. May. You would be clear if you asked me about it before yeah. we started recording. <laughs> There's a method to my madness. I thought this was a brainstorming session where we were going to brainstorm. No, we're right. talking about it. We um, talked about this at the Brad Highway. I'm so sorry, but I can't justify it. Because I can't it. really watch mm-hmm. the old one because <laughs> of about it in the thread. Okay, so if a horror <laughs> show fan shows up to the panel, I freak out every time I start exactly to exactly what it. all our choices are I ahead of time. So what's the point of going to the panel? Well, no, After it's after. we're <laughs> throwing out some. But this one, I that's what I'm saying. All right. Well, no, that's then I'm not worried about. Then they're still going to come and listen to vampire, why we choose what we choose. Um, okay, so we're, uh, okay. And they can put in that. We, we have to figure this out ahead of time. Okay. And we're going to record it because that's what we've done the last couple of years. Okay. Okay. Wow, guys. Here, here, this is the thread I put well, in if you want to have some help. I have okay. All right. Marsha, what are yours? Go ahead. What's your number one? I thought we wanted mystery for the panel. Sorry. that's We've never had mystery before, so we're not starting now. All right. Go ahead. My number one is Pet Cemetery, a mix of both. The new one, though. <laughs> or, or are you yes. saying a, really? I'm going to say a mix of both because I can't well you're taking mm. two movies off the table for uh, someone then well we're all going to talk we usually end up discussing having a big discussion of each movie yeah but you're we? still you're you're taking the remake and the original that's two movies that you're taking if you're saying I mean we're going to really talk about Pet Cemetery once Pet Cemetery, or twice yeah, like yeah. I feel like we're yeah. going to all talk about it even okay alright so, so, like me yeah. opening the book will allow everybody else to talk about it I don't think we should like there should be two people Picking the same franchise. Well, but it's two separate movies in the same franchise, is what I was saying. We can still all talk about it, though. But someone else might want to pick one of those, is what I'm saying. You're you're taking two. Okay, I will pick the one. new one then. Okay. If it will make you happy, we'll see. We'll see. It might it might not come into effect, but He's if like, it does, we'll we'll see what happens. Yet. If it makes you if it makes you happy, I will go with the second one. It can't be that bad. <laughs> if it makes you happy, then why are you so sad? Oh God, I hate you so much right now. <laughs> All right, so I can't. I can't do the. I'm not going to be at the remake. My one, first so. one is I'm claiming the final girls. Okay. Um, Susie, you do you have me? one? I don't. I'm so sorry. I don't. I'm saying none at all. I, d- I don't have. I didn't. All right. Well, bring here, the here. Onion. This is what some of the killer flicksters. So look through. <laughs> the photo I, I made that post. <laughs> the photo you're seeing was one of them. The one that I thought of. So. Okay. Well, none of us have chosen it. So do you want to okay. call that one? Which oh, one? you're getting a phone call. <laughs> From Mike. Oh, Cypher's calling. Oh, well, I can't talk Live right on now. air. Mike said. Right. Yeah. Wait, which one did you say, Jaime? Uh, I'll tell him right. Which one did you say? Right um, well, it was one that Anyone popped up on his little thread there, but it was one of the few that I thought of. And okay. It's, I the, get it's the end of the mist. Some feels for the movies, end of the mist? The of the is that a movie or a show? Um, it was a television. Oh, uh, excuse me. It was a... Jesus. <laughs> uh, it was the... That uh, turned you on? <laughs> That's what you said? That's what? what you just said. <laughs> so I'm not wrong. That's crazy. Uh, I was attempting to say that threw me off. But, uh, <laughs> he said that turned me on. I was like, it's because I was noise? switching between sentences. Stop. You're going to make me pee. Yes. The end of the mist <laughs> turned me on. I got to be me on. In my pants. All right. Everybody so, is going to have so much fun with this podcast. Oh. So the mist. Okay. So Fuego went with the mist. I hope one. people listen okay, to it. Okay. I'm so sorry. What? I, um, yeah. I'm bringing it back to you. All right, there you go. I don't remember. No, I don't remember oh what the movie's called. But there's a young girl, mother or something, two young girls, and it's, the spirit comes. Yes, yeah, m- mama. Mama. Oh, mama, okay. I'm, that I'll made you that. cry? Really? That's a sound it, it, that got you emotionally? I was thinking you'd say mm. Conjuring 2. Okay, no, that one for sure. Okay, yes, yeah. Conjuring 2. You can have that as your second. Too. Okay. But yeah, do you want mama? Okay. Mama, yeah, okay. that. 
And I she's taking Conjuring too. Right, right. So. You got to understand. I was like, Whoa. oh wait, I put my okay. name down. That's fine. Susie. The finale of End Games. Okay, so Susie's no. picture two. Yeah, two. she's got Conjuring and Mama. I want to try and get each of us to five, but we're gonna That's do a top lot three. For emotional movies. There's more emotional than you think. Movies? There's more than Maybe you think. That- I feel like that's, I mean, that's going to be we'll at see. least nine. Um, I know, I know, I know. For Depending on how many people we have. I'm just, I want to make sure we have enough time. Okay. Like, we need to go to the audience at some so point, too, for the last few minutes. Right. Audience I'm reaction, maybe, to each one after well, we well, announce well, not, No, I don't know about audience <laughs> reaction to each one, but <laughs> ones we <laughs> miss by the end, we can get audience okay. other ones, that's you good. know what I mean? That's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sad feels. So, okay, so Fuego, do you have a number? Marsha, I know I know one of yours is Haunting of Hill House, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll put that as your number two. Is it, like, specific beats in the home yeah which hotel? one do you want to do because there's at least two moments in there right the i think the brent bent neck lady is one so what which one were you thinking marcia um were you thinking one too fuego i'm guessing no the one, well, the, one i think it is six the, 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 the long one the long where time. they're at the the funeral the, yeah this is, that's episode six mm-hmm. that's not what i would go with that's okay the, so what would you so that's okay. if i was i mean go with I, I i don't think it's fair that i have to just pick one though okay. like the whole well, thing that's a, a 10 episode series not one movie so that's not fair that you get but if you 10 like, full like, episodes, again, that's 10 hours I'm, versus one movie and we can argue all night but again i think it's a waste <laughs> of audience time to there's just like you said there's just so much content out there yeah. for I know, but the, the point is these, to, these moments made you made you cry but not emotional overall and so it'd be like a to, moment like i don't okay to yeah, to for multiple <laughs> people to be picking the same like but it's different series. episodes that, and that's fine I but can, we're all going to be talking about each one anyway so for no. like and it's the same thing that happened in. with well um, I, look, i'm just i'm just american horror story and some of the other panels i'm we fine had. with her taking all of it but i'm just I'm, i don't want you to be time, upset that she's taking all of it i'm not bummed out i have so many other things okay fine then you're fine take it off that's fine i was only i was only arguing because i thought he's still gonna have an opportunity to talk about it i understand i understand but you're gonna be taking the thunder of most of it though so yeah. right because so, i so called it you, that's right claim, yeah, <laughs> you gotta treat you, you gotta treat it as a whole if you claim a property you claim a property, claim a property. So. and so and, and so that's <laughs> why if we're all claiming properties i'm claiming buffy because of the fact that when go buffy, for it when buffy right. died and which one and, and, season and, five and, and, or yes, season one where, where she was where she died Do it. there's a lot of good heaven, stuff on buffy and, and when we can she all was talk to back, it, well that's, that's season point. five and six so that's that's it's season the, five it's a little and then over. and then it's they once upon a time of feeling she, yeah after she buffy, saved but that's like halfway through season six so well no when she saves the world and they resurrect her and like the saddest shit yeah but it's not revealed that it's sad until once upon a time of feeling which is more than halfway through season six the musical episode yeah I thought that right after they... No, well, that's not right after. No, because she's around for a while. so long since She's I've around for a while well, before she tells her friends what happened. That's the thing, you have time to, like, happened. really, like... Okay, well, it's... No, but it's fine. Again, I'm not trying to... I'm just... If I'm going to own the whole series, like Marsha was just talking about that... Well, but that's seven yeah. seasons. Yeah, haunting. Haunting. That's haunting seven seasons house, of 23 so. episodes. But that's the, the a thing lot. is, is we all can talk to it. There, we all have a moment for Buffy that we really can talk about. And I think the, that's what's going to make it Calendar, interesting. The death of her mom. It's okay if okay, but if the, 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 the But the panel uh-huh. can't be forever. Uh-huh. I'm saying you have to zero in on something. Like, you no, can't but, just so, say all the, all the shit in Buffy that... Made you sad because that's gonna fucking well, no, take forever. I didn't want to say that initially. I, I wanted to. Okay, I as I said, pinpoint the revelation. Like where we can pinpoint. She was in heaven yeah. and she was happy and she was upset. Okay, so that's that part were, of five and six. That's what she I wrote down. Upset that they brought her back. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so where where'd really, my phone really go? Sad. Where's mine? <laughs> um, Spirited podcast, everyone. Hey. So another one of mine was the monster. I just want to rewatch the House of Haunted or the, the Hill, Haunted, Haunted of Hill House, house oh, again, so, so I can really like that whole thing. Is I was so gonna much. say the end of episode five. That's what yeah. I still. That's what still crushes Wait, me. Wait, that's when um, where she starts. Where Susie, she do you have a third? The, where the the youngest sibling, I'm I'm forgetting her name. She gets to the house. I don't think and she, she thinks she's dancing with her dead husband. Yeah, and I don't all think that, I was not the that made same. Me I'm not the same as everybody on the bed mm-hmm. net, like lady though. There was another one that was really more. See, I thought Bent Neck Lady was the saddest one. Mm. Okay. You, probably, you guys are probably going to laugh at me, but something that made me super emotional, mm-hmm. only from personal experience, mm-hmm. was Paranormal Activity. Mm-hmm. Which one? Paranormal. The first one? That That's the one that or triggered it. the one with it. the babies. Yeah, that really didn't help. Yeah. 
so okay. you're taking paranormal activity. Yeah. That's good. Uh, there's some good stuff on par- paranormal activity. I Just, again, too. because of personal experience. So. so for my third, I'll take Train to Busan. Uh, Wait, what was your second? The, the monster. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's got the so I got the girls, final girls, the monster, and train, train to Busan. Busan. Yeah. Damn it, you took the you final girls. girls. Man. Train to Busan. Yeah, he's. Yeah. yeah. I would want final girls. Oh, okay. final oh, girls yeah. got me like the very first time we walked out of that theater. I was floored by Dude, that. Dude, I. That was a beautiful movie. That was a good one. It was that, so it's good. so good. Yeah. Tyson Formiga I hate you and so much. Malin Ackerman fucking rocked the house. <clears throat> that movie. Truly, truly yeah. good. That was really Have you seen Eden Lake though? Like, I can loan you Eden Lake to see if you want to call that one or. Because I'm, I'm looking at all Can these other ones. The Wolfman one? from 2010, someone said. Can I put my I third one? Why. Yeah, go ahead. My What's third your... one was Afflicted. Okay. Yeah, it's a good one. That made you uh, get emotional, huh? Well, yeah. It's such a, like, feels movie. Because you have the two best friends. One has, you know, cancer. And they go on this road, road trip. And then he ends up, you know, becoming it's a vampire. No, no one's claimed a quiet place yet. That's he a really becomes a vampire. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Man. Let the right one in. No, I would, I, I would take a. I'll nothing do that's an a quiet alternate. place. That'll be my number four. Because again, we, we should have invoked, five. Like, so, yeah. so I'll take a quiet place for my potential four. alternates. Someone else also said, "I am legend." The moment I was thinking about, I am legend. To be honest, yeah. Do you want that as your four? Like yeah. you that as your four? All right, yeah. I'll put it's that as your four. To I'm gonna put like down five for everyone. The dog. Yeah, the dog. Absolutely. All right, so I got I that's your four, Marsha. That so you're married to a few selections, and dog, if you think of something in the eleventh hour, but yeah, nonetheless, yeah. I mean, you We're have g- everyone's going to have choices. their top their top three, but they're going to have an alternate too. So I am Legend is your fourth, Marsha. I'm going fourth with one. a quiet place for mine. I got a fourth one. Okay. Hmm. Tusk. Okay. Yeah. That made you emotional. Yeah. Okay. No, it, like tusk? emotional, like he's gone discomfort. Full yeah, discomfort. Happy Death Day to it's You, like, another horror it's... movie that got me crying. Oh well, yeah. I mean, it's you hard. know what? I might actually. Really I'll put that as my five. Jaime have horror. a third? No, not no, not yet. <laughs> do you do you have some ideas? Like, <laughs> wait, what? you have a fifth, Cecil? I can't catch up. Like this guy. That's all you said. I mean, I really. Wait, I you might had say Happy Death Day to you. For me. Yeah, A Quiet Place and Happy Death Day to you. Oh, was oh yeah, okay, Quiet Place. <laughs> happy Death Day. Because that shit made me cry when she saw her parents again and stuff. That was that good was in the middle of a. Oh, that was really good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that when was her really mom good. was alive again. Yeah, that was actually I didn't ge- see that. genuinely. It was really good. For sure. Yeah. I, I cried. Um, I cried straight up. And I cried. <laughs> Um, okay, so I'm just going to read some of these others. Um, oh, everyone says, Marsha, this might be your five, when Sheriff Brackett finds his daughter in the oh, Rob Zombie Halloween dude, 2. Yeah. And he starts fucking freaking out and crying. Steven like, Dorf in Halloween 2. Best part. I, I thought the Sheriff Brackett bit with, with, with him was good, but, you know, it's up to you. That was just another example. Um, I mean, I guess it's more sci-fi. Someone said The Fly, Misery, so The Orphanage, sad, like, Carrie, emotional Devil's emotional Backbone. Well, obviously. The fly, the fly too the fly was really sad. Very, very the sad. fly too made me you super know what? Can sad. I do like? I might actually do the fly too as one of mine can instead I, of Happy Death Day. I want to do something with yeah, supernatural. Like, I was thinking that too. Okay. Like um, when Jeffrey D. Moore, the the moment when Jeffrey D. Moore when they come back and they have yeah. their dinner. Make me upset. Okay, I can pull that for you. Because that's that's why I want to get this. I want to pull all this stuff. I want to pull all of these scenes for the for to show to the audience. Yeah, because like when when they had to say goodbye to Jeffrey, Don't you think, so right? Jeffrey D. Morgan again. I'll yeah. need your guys' help, but I want to pull all of these scenes to show the audience. I yeah. want to load it on your on your laptop, you all of them. Yeah. Huh? You I have to reform up my laptop. Um, so I'm gonna do the fly too, because that shit made me cry when I was a kid. Well, the fly too. The fly too made me cry. That's your that's six. That's, for you. I know, I know, I know. I gotta decide. I might put that over Happy Death Day to you. We'll see. Hmm. Susie, do you have a fifth or? You know, uh, not offhand. I'm thinking, because I mean, like I said, there's there's movies that make me emotional, and the kind of emotional you're thinking about, I don't have one off the top of my head. Hmm. I I feel Honestly, like Walking Dead. Like yeah, I really I want to do Glenn, but I flowers? can't because look at the I, flowers. Look at the flowers. Oh, that was emotional. so good. I can't do yeah. like Glenn. I feel like is a. Soft right, so part Marsh, with are so you taking people, Supernatural as your number it. five then? Super, or is, yeah. are you giving Fuego Supernatural for number five? Well, number I did. Five? If I did Buffy already, something. From okay. Buffy, All right. So, I, Marcia, I, I your your number I five is Supernatural. I'm still I watching Supernatural. I am too. So did you watch? I watched the finale. 
Episode 20 was the finale. I'm not even going to try to watch that. Mm-hmm. What do you mean? Like this season? The season finale. Yeah, yeah it's, it's up. Oh, it's up. Yeah, yeah, I haven't watched it yet. It's on. It's How many are you behind? It's on the shorter order this year. I like this. I'll just 40, this one. 40. I haven't watched. Oh, did you see who came back in the last one? <laughs> oh, he might have just come back in this one. <laughs> I smell back because like those guys. Started I think so. Yeah. Other than that, they each did. Someone else came back. Who? I mean, Lucifer's been back. Oh no, not that. That's it. I mean, all right, watch it. All right. Yeah, they they ended season. I was like, oh shit, they ended with episode twenty. They didn't go to twenty two or twenty three. They got a shorter order this year. Yeah, so because they only have one more season. So it's done. It's I I'm I'm caught up. We're so watch that and we can review season of Supernatural. Is it Bobby again? Lucifer came back again. Yeah, I know. Someone, oh, someone, that's such a great actor. Someone disappeared a couple oh, seasons. Oh, you know, no, okay, and that's a, and that's about oh. to. That, that's about that to is come coming back, back though. So, yes. so someone else said the orphanage um, martyrs is yeah, also on the list a, for emotional. I've never watched that school. one, so I can't. Martyrs, okay. You see, I would say the. What about a Serbian uh, film? Mm-hmm. It didn't make us cry, but it was emotional. Yeah, and it, was, oh, it was definitely emotional that that end scene. I feel like I want to do something with Walking Dead, maybe. Well, you already have your fun. <gasps> Carl. 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 No, that I'm was... like, who is the saddest death on the Walking Dead? <laughs> Therese. Not... Did you ever see that? <laughs> I feel like Therese was. No, I think uh, what's her name, the mom. Oh, Lori. Honestly, honestly, that was a happy moment for I me. I might even go the sister in the first season. That was really Fuego, really sad. you I mean, we're doing movies and TV. You could do a Stephen King book moment, you know, that made you so really like emotional. Sad. Any well, any horror, horror that makes well, you book, really emotional. Okay. The the book moment is at the very end of the book it where Well you tell me, do you want that to be one of them? Yeah, I will because they still never got that right in all honesty. Okay, so it's, book it book it ending. And, and it's it's Are you sad ready right for now? the sure yeah. fact that oh. Like, what after he, he rides, uh, you know, uh, white silver look at the away, pink, whatever the fuck he's the pink the bike, which is totally off, off the top of my head right at the moment, but it, it's where you hey, start to realize that even after the reconnection that they have as so, adults, here, you about their, their recollection of each other is already fading away, like, they're forgetting last names, <laughs> they're forgetting, they're like, they're like, what was Ow, did you, oh, was did you lick me? I was like, did you bite me? You're like, in, like, really blah, 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 you know, what other profession, and... Just the fact that Are you they get back to Derry hey, and they remember each other so well. what are you doing? So well. on a side conversation while yeah. Fuego's answering no, your question? No, like your cat's attacking me. Sorry. It's, well, no, don't, the cat don't, don't pay attention and to her. It really, really fine. does. Yeah, as far as like the saddest and most bittersweet emotional endings to anything Stephen King, the end of it is far beyond what you see in Pet Cemetery. What you see in the this stand. This was pretty good I too. Mean, this is on someone's list. The Evil Within. That did actually have some emotion That had a very to happy it. emotional ending. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. You know, it's not it's not horror enough, unfortunately. But yeah. I would go with the end of Terminator Two, mm-hmm. where he's being lowered into the lava. And I would count that. I feel like the I would count that. I still count Sonic Terminator Two as a horror movie. I would. I, I, well, Do you want that? that? I, I would definitely call that. Two? Right. Really, a horror movie? Yeah. That's hard sci-fi. Dude, there's a dude. Sci-fi horror. He's trying to kill John Connor the entire movie. And he's killing people in his way. Yeah, but not in a horrific way. So well, is there anything from Aliens? He sticks. Is there anything from Alien that got to you? Honestly, the end of Alien Three, where Ripley is do you want jumping that? into the, I could do that. Would you rather that or T Two? I'll give you T Two. I don't care. That's close enough to horror for me to count. I feel like lose right where I'll get shit for. The All right, <laughs> do you want to <laughs> Alien Three then? The the fact that, but, 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 but yes, I, I love Terminator Two. I I would say that I'm I would give you shit for it. I'm not like, even Terminator. I'm bad. okay with Alien Three. I, I've warmed up to Alien Three over the years. I did not like it for a long. So do you time. want that as one or no? Can we put them down as maybes? Like, uh, I mean, I mean that's the thing. If we're amassing a list, Susie, of, like, do you, you have, have a like fifth? Five, you have like five. I think six I on do. There. Okay. And I and honestly, these are all up to, at the top of my head right now. Okay. And from what I just watched, and it's only from the opener hmm. of Wolf Creek series. Oh. Oh. That was pretty emotional. That for you, was. Huh? That's that's good. Oh, the Wolf Creek series. You know, I forgot. I can't we wait need to re- did you finish it? I finished it. I watched the whole thing. Oh shit! Is we should good? review that before. I have Shutter. Oh, I just gotta go. All right. Yeah, that's. Yeah. Yeah. It's, okay. It's well, I, I watched we'll the whole thing. We'll review it next time. Okay. So uh, did you like it? Oh wow! Yeah. Like. I'm excited for that. Review I'm then. glad you guys forced me to watch it. I mean, I don't. It's know like how... a really long version of one of those movies mm-hmm. over it's generations. Not, it's, no, almost. you know what? It's not even that. I loved how it went into like i love seeing how people work i watch those serial killer shows and everything and this just really like in tune everything and 
Oh my god. That, I remember I was watching it. I was sending you guys a message. I was like, what the fuck is going on? It was intense. And it really showed the mm -hmm. savageness mm -hmm. of him, which I wish they would have shown, like, in the other movies. Um, but, yeah. That first episode, that first, what, 20 minutes mm -hmm. in, I was like, wow, it really went there. And mm -hmm. a lot of movies, huge production movies, don't go there. And it did. And I was like, okay. wow. So, so you want the, it would be the beginning of that series that you'd want? The, or I, the, I, the, the attack on the family kind of it thing? Really, or what would you yeah. Want? Okay. It really set the tone for the whole movie, I think. But seeing that in the beginning, re despite even the movies, what happened in that film? Uh, beginning episode in the beginning of it really showed who you're kind of dealing with that I had no idea mm -hmm. you know what I mean because it's one thing to kill a full grown person mm -hmm. but it's entirely other to do it to something else that I won't get into mm -hmm. um, oh, that I that uh, I can only imagine where that went it, it, <laughs> I was not expecting it at all and it went there and I was like wow that really shook me up so cool all right we can call that and I think okay. pulling the clips of all this stuff I think it's going to make for a really good panel because just so you guys know they can vote on panels this year um, oh, they're, really? they're, they can rate them on a star rating system this That's year. Wow, really we awesome. better not fuck up, guys. We, we <laughs> never have. Like, I yeah, wish I... they had rating systems in the past for our panels, yeah. but let's yeah. just keep it up, you know? Yeah. So I need everyone to send me exactly what points of all these movies they want, so that way I can pull all the appropriate clips and I send them to Marsha for the, for the thumbnail. Well, with the no, not necessarily. I mean, the, the family attack at the beginning of that I can get, but... Conjuring 2. Well, that, okay, that part was the stairs and the rolling the ball out of the tent and stuff like that. Yeah, I remember. I remember you literally tearing up right next to me like, oh, man. All right, so, all I right, mean, guys. I mean, I honestly even think that as far as an emotional response goes, like. So here's like, the thing. That's panel one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So real quick, we'll get through the next two. I don't think the next two are going to take as long. So. Um, let's do number two, which was Stephen King's Year of 19 panel. Fuego, this one's this pretty much where, all on you. Yeah, and that's the thing. I, Who's going to be on all? this panel? That's what I was curious about. I mm -hmm. could be on it. I, I wanted Stephen, you no. to be on it. I mean, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be, be on up it. on a lot of the remake stuff, so I can be on it too, but just not as a... Is it all what? just for, tw like, person. on 2019 yeah. then? Like, yeah. the stuff for he's doing yeah. for 2019? Yeah, yeah, it's basically our impressions about the stuff that has already happened in the year of 19, <clears> and then the things that are still to come. So it's going to be us talking about just some impressions of Pet Cemetery, which is the only thing which will be out at that particular point. Okay. And then we're going to talk about the stuff that's coming later, like which is it, the, which mm. is it chapter two in coming in September, grass. which is in the tall grass, which is still dated for 2019 on Netflix, but still has yet to Doctor Sleep yet to see something. Doctor Sleep, which is a new edition because it was originally coming out in January of 2020, and then they shifted it up to November. That means the studio believes in it. So you have to start pulling all of those graphics and stuff if to compile any into beyond like a, a book cover. What well, about I mean, wasn't there something that. else yeah. like a show? Oh, there's there's a few other season things. Two. There's still the Castle second Rock. season of Castle Rock, which we have a full on description for. There's the third season of Mr. Mercedes. There's um, a third one. Coming there's a third out? season. I, still and I gotta and watch it yeah, before we get rid of. And that means I need to finish the second Do season, and cable? we need to try to review seasons one and two before the panel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay, anyway. so you're on top of that. And, so. and there's a new novel which is coming, The Institute, which is arriving in September, and I can basically just talk about the description. We'll just we have chime in where we can. Point. Wait, it, when's um? Plus two of the his vampire guy coming out. Oh my gosh. Yes. Most about to. You know, we can, <laughs> honestly, we can make it King family. I, I do it on the Hill to Stephen King Facebook group enough. We can at least briefly touch on the end about Nosferatu. So who's going to be on that panel? Is it going to be you, me, Marsha, and who? That's a good question. What, I mean, do you have people you want to bring into it or what? Do we have an, an available pass for somebody to come that day? I can't send their name in at this point, but yeah. we can give them someone else's pass for that, for that moment, mm -hmm. you know, for that panel. I mean, maybe Christopher R. Smith. <laughs> oh, Christ. No. no. Never, I mean, that's just one of the No Dirk, things. no Chris Smith. Okay. Well, you heard it here first, y'all. 
Um, <laughs> Don't give no fucks. Well, because the, you know he hasn't reached out to me. He just jumped out of the group, so I'm assuming he's done until he reaches oh, well, out. Which is about. okay. I'll tell you, you're done. <laughs> shit. Fucking Terry. Oh, wow. Snap. Oh, wow. I don't give a fuck. No, I'm sorry. I mean, that's pretty no, fucking shitty of you to fucking I mean, do. That's why I said Chris instead of Kirk. But um, no. No, I'm sorry. That's pretty fucking maybe. shitty. You haven't said I mean, anything. Um, We've done a lot for you. We just he's not. Yeah, find someone that's actually that lively. Did. That's not just sitting there waiting to have balls pitched at him. No, okay. he needs someone that's that's like us that has some energy and stuff. Yeah, so, but but yeah, basically no, the sorry. whole little uh, description that we have. What are you doing? Yeah, go ahead, Fuego. Read the description that you wrote. Yeah. Yeah, so, Larry, what are you doing? <laughs> long days and pleasant nights, fellow travelers, along the path of the beam. We are known on this level of the tower as the Horror Show Channel, and if it please you, join our YouTube show here for a bit of palaver all about Cy Stephen King in his monumental year of nineteen. And the reason for that is because. The number 19 is very pivotal and essential and important. Is that part of, of the, this? Yeah, that's Did the, you write that? I, I wrote that. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I, the, I was ad-libbing from there. But oh. the, the, the rest of the description is, from remakes and sequels on television and film to a monstrous new novel, 2019 will be like no other for constant readers, both new and old. And, cool. Yeah. I like it. But, uh, yeah, I mean, there's lots of exciting <laughs> stuff to discuss, as we <laughs> mentioned, and... Uh, just the number 19 is it's it's big in the dark tower books and he even has a little like introduction that he wrote to the gunslinger where he was talking about the importance of the 19th year in your life and the fact that you're leaving high school you're going to college you're becoming an adult it's just a very formative period as far as just an ascension into maturity and so yeah i I don't know. It's, so do you think that's why there's so much stuff coming out in 2019, Stephen King? Or do you think he just has a lot of momentum going on right now? He has with a shitload it. of momentum going since two years ago when the first date came out and 1922 and Gerald's Game and all the stuff that hit that year. Uh, the, the Miss series, not not so much. But <laughs> there was some, like that, that was the year where it was like he was reclaiming his throne. And I think this year in particular is where he's he's sitting on it and he is just you know rocking it proper it's it's crazy the amount of stuff there's also a colorado kid uh illustrated edition that's coming out in may Ooh, there's, there's, i'm there's, excited about that yeah i just heard about it yeah which is uh, i just, heard just about i do like i'm yeah. a big fan of the colorado kid yeah, because well, of well, the tv haven. yeah because yeah. of haven mm -hmm. i love that which show. i've still never watched and i really i, I really told people on the hill to stephen King group that i wanted to Start going through that show because I'll watch it with you because I hear it's Easter Egg City. Oh you yeah, know? it's huge. I, I haven't yeah. watched that or the Dead Zone TV show. I haven't you watched never either of those. I mean, I watched a couple episodes, but yeah. I mean, I well, it was okay. Right. Well, let's get yeah. to the third panel and end it up. Um, so the third panel is nerve-wracking remakes from Pet Cemetery to Child's Play in 2019 alone. Join Arizona's own The Horror Show channel from YouTube as they discuss the scary trend in the horror genre of remaking old films rather than developing new original properties. Mm. So basically on this one, I mean, we may need to develop the format a little bit more later because it's already getting kind of late and we have a lot to do. But um, this one I just wanted to, we could talk about the remakes we were getting in this year, some of the remakes that we've gotten recently our overall thoughts on why we think remakes happen, you know, as opposed to new original properties. And um, I think a fun part of it would be what remakes do you think would be good to do and what remakes should they not bother with and stuff like that. I mean... Oh, like, like what they... Sh okay, I see what you're saying. So not like things that they've already remade that we'd like. like right. Like Tom, no, so some other properties that haven't been remade let, remade yet. Let's, yeah, let's think of some of that. Awesome. So like, like, I think a lot of that would be fun. So... Um, so like aside from the holy trinity of 80s remakes. So I'll write down I'll write down 2019 blah. remakes. We'll start with those. And then uh, we will go with recent remakes. Which would be stuff like what? Nightmare Poltergeist, Elm Street, Nightmare on Elm Street, the, uh, yeah, Friday the 13th, Dawn stuff Dawn like the that. Dead. And then old school remakes, which would be The Thing, The Blob, right? That's mm -hmm. Yeah, the fly. That's the, the fly. that's the that's the trinity of eighties yeah. horror okay. craziness. And then um, what they should remade. what well, yeah what what should be remade. Mm -hmm. What should what you should really remake. Be remade. So I think if if each of us chose yeah, one movie, you know, if we chose more than that, it would take a long time. I don't know. We'll a lot see. of people disagree with me, but I say they live. It has so much more social, just. 
Did we, like we say like people under the stairs, Susie? Didn't we say people under the stairs? We thought would be yes, really good if they really redid remake, it. I think. Yeah, yeah, if they redid it, it's a really good. Like if they remade, <laughs> like, like they did. It's a an amazing I don't know that, story. Those four it. things it's might Jordan be enough. I mean, so we have the 2019 remakes, we have recent remakes, we have <laughs> old school remakes, remakes, and then we have what should be remade. And this is the. And I mean, this is the panel Lou's gonna be. I think you would be perfect for that. Yeah, on this one. Yeah. yeah. So what do you what do you guys think? Is there anything Let's besides those that we should Let's do in the remake him. panel, or yeah. is that enough for a full panel? That might be enough for a yeah. full panel. Yeah. It's really with, funny with, that I like realized when we were doing the review earlier, The Exorcist. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You think they should remake that? There's no <laughs> remake for it. There should be. There hasn't been like one. No, it's true. Like, no Which is crazy to me that they I haven't remade that movie. Remake. Remake. Nobody it wants to touch enough, it. Yeah. No one wants to touch the classic. I guess. Remake. I would say Exorcist. Because no one wants to touch it. All right. Well, that can wow, be your choice. That's ballsy All right. That can some, be your choice. So I would be some, ballsy. Somebody All right. So we'll stick with people these four. Under the stairs. There's some films that people, people think. People under the stairs. But you're not going to be on that panel. No, no, I said somebody needs to pick oh, it. People under the stairs. I'm trying to think. <laughs> I'm like, I'm call out for Marsha. I think they should read By Jordan Peele. All right. So Susie is Exorcist and People Under the Stairs. Yeah. Right. By Jordan Peele specifically. By Jordan Peele, yes, you know, specifically. Yeah, you know, which they tried so goddamn yeah, hard. Yeah, Corin mean, Hardy, like all these other people, Jason Crow, Momoa. Remake um, the Crow. You know, no. I've been saying for a while that I would Blaster. love to see, I would love to see a Bucky, remake I'll of say the Crow. <gasps> Deadly Friend, Wes <laughs> Craven. Because that movie got <laughs> hammy and silly and everything. And just, just the emotional heft Brandon of, Lee is you know, sad. Let him finish. Guy working on robot and everything, and robot, you know, gets messed up and destroyed, and then falls in love with the girl next door. Girl next door gets abused and killed by parent. He uses his like, you know, scientific technology that he's been developing to bring this girl back, but she comes back not quite the same, and she starts killing people herself. And then, right before she gets killed again, he gets that last little just what movie bit. Is? This is Deadly Friend. A lot of people have not seen I've Wes Craven's Deadly Friend. It's a Wes Craven movie. Christy Swanson. I know one of mine is going to be Jaws. I think you so should stick with the people shit. under the oh, yeah. Remake Jaws as opposed yep. to sequel? Yeah, remake. see, you want that. Yep. Remake Discussion. Jaws. I'm trying to find a yeah. movie that, By like, Cecil Laird. is really <laughs> crappy, yep. but has, like, a good, like, I don't know. I gotta, see, I gotta that was the people some... under the stairs. What are some of your, what are you, some movie, you're thinking? Story. I don't know. Like, I want, you ever see a movie called Paperboy? No. I played a you video, video game, game called Paperboy. No, it's about this boy who was, like, kind of like this. Boy, do you have another thought, or? And then, like, Something to think like, about. Well, I said, well, I said they live like, already. Oh, they live. That's, that's, that's definitely like, the, the one that I always like champion. Okay. Like, um, so we'll just go three each. Dudes are flirting with her. Um, I'll have to think what? of some others. <laughs> Something like that. That sounds mm. like a horrible thing. <laughs> <laughs> so what should I think? I think it'll have to be what should be remake. What should be remade and how should they remake it? To Whoa. Make it different. Well, yeah. To, well, yeah. Just to. I think it has to be. You can't just say. Okay, they should yeah, remake okay. Jaws. Well, you don't so want no, to. People that's say it. Should be remade by Jordan Peele. You don't want a Gus Van Sant psycho. Okay, no, no, but that's, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> and how? I'm, and I'm how? Adding. And, and how? how. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so what should be remade and how? That's asking a lot. Yeah, but Susie, I mean, there's gotta what be. What are you gonna do about Jaws? Don't worry about it. Pat. Exactly. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's like, I'll answer it during the like panel. Well, for yeah. the people under the stairs, it definitely needs to have more serious. What about feel like the craft or other witchy versus movies? the camping? Well, the don't the touch the craft. The craft. It's it's being. Being. I understand. No. I'm just saying other remade. witchy movies. Think about that shit. The craft is being craft. remade, by the way. You can, is it being remade? It is. What about a remake of The Witches of Eastwick? That would be a good yeah, one. Dude, that, what that, about that's witches? Yeah. 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 What about Jack witches? Jack, Jack you want me to write Nicholson that down for you? Yeah, I'll do that one. All right. All right. All right. With who, Cher? No. Um, well, that's what yeah. that would be like, up to her. Witches. So, Susie, you're well, going to have to figure out how would you remake right these with who? As and like all that the main Yeah, I'll do that. All right. You got witches of Eastwood. She's going to be in it. And Hathaway ruins everything. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Or the witches. Yeah, they are. They're remaking the witches. Yeah. Is she going to be like. The she's main. gonna be Angela, Angelica Houston, I think. Oh, oh you know they should remake. Everything. Well, what do you think she's gonna be? The little boy? Since they put, I mean, she come on. ruins everything. 
Anne so, so Hathaway ruined everything. Everything. No way. Her tits are amazing in certain movies. But they're not going to be in the movie because Anne Hathaway? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> yeah. I'm, 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 I'm with you on Anne Hathaway being hot. You never All right, so Fuego, do you have another one besides those two? How about they remake Little Monsters with Finn Wolfhard? Ooh, Little Monsters. That's actually not bad. You want me to write that down? Sure, why not? Little Monsters isn't bad. That could be a remake. That could be a remake. That could be a remake. No, I like that. Little different. Monsters the is a good Angela, choice. Uh, what's her I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep thinking name? about it. Angela. I'm gonna yeah. keep thinking about it. Yeah, yeah this for is one where Lou, you don't have, you don't have a single one. Oh, there was one movie I saw years ago. It was what? Like an old house they go to the, 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 but being in the theater, I was about to say, I would love to see a remake you of Popcorn. Have to have seen this I movie. really, really dig that awesome. one. But nobody really goes to theaters as much unless they're going to see That's Avengers. No, so yeah. you, never, you, have you don't to go watch for horror movies anymore. Seen they watch them on the Your kids can Netflix, watch it. It's you know? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lou, you don't have it's any down, so we've got to get three choices have, from you at some point. That's one of my favorite movies. It's funny. Growing up. Yeah. Just look at stuff that haven't scene, gotten remakes or sequels. There's this whole yeah. scene yeah. about like, oh, this, I'd love to see a new uh, version of that. Yeah. That's what I'll do. I've got this girl whole section over here. I'll fucking and sit down and do that. And honestly, parents, nothing in production right now that we've already heard some peening, sort of rumblings about being remade. I, I just, I want Jaws with the shallows effect. And that, like, has haunted me my whole life. No. No. No, but Demons is a good one. I think Demons is the last action hero of horror movies. You off that she's taking. You know well, what? Last Action Hero would be good, too. Okay. Remake End of Days. Remake End of Days okay. with Chris Pratt. So what Pratt. if there's a movie that it is in, <laughs> <laughs> it's in the works of a remake, but it hasn't been done yet? Like what? Mm, well, that would I'm be saying, tough I'm because asking. there's like stuff like Tommy Knockers. I want to see. Remake no, I think it should be stuff that's not already in the works. Oh. Yeah. No, no, I just think balls. you should personally watch that because I think your life is missing that. What? Which one are you talking about? What if it's already? She's never seen The Witches. What if it's already? What? Do you have it? Do you own it? What has? What's, what's that? <laughs> what if it's already uh, been remade? No, I don't. Uh... So if it's like the Blob situation, well, you well, know, or if it's like this is like uh, ones that have been remade, right? It's a kids. It's a kids horror movie yeah. for sure. No, I, I almost want to change it. The moment when he loses his parents in that movie, or mm. or even like the moment when the 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 girl in the painting dies, like she's no longer there. Spoiler. Oh, Amazon. Oh. Okay. Okay, I'll watch that. So sad. All right, so, All right, so I, I guess we'll we'll call it there because it's just Lou and I that don't have full. Oh, yeah. Lou doesn't have any down. He's the host. Well, I, mean, I don't one. have. He's the hotel manager. Go back and see. Yeah. All right. I mean, all the movies. Like, all my favorite horror <clears throat> movies have been remade. Okay. Pretty much. A good deal of them. Yeah. Well, think about ones that you I would don't like, like but you think Head. would have been good if you did it different. I thought they were but working that's... on one on one particular part. Because you have to, oh, you have to talk oh, about no, how no. you would make it yeah. different. Okay. Like, think about movies. I would say Near Dark, but I feel like they already did a Near Ooh, Dark that's remake. not a bad. No, I don't know that they have. Not, they haven't done a Near Dark remake, but they did a movie Forsaken. Do you want to call Near Dark or what? I don't have to think about it. I don't know how it would be. Oh, put it down as a possibility. Put it down as a maybe situation, yeah. yeah. Because we have to, we have to be, yeah. Exactly. You gotta pick like, three, so. Well, it's like, oh, this is how I would do it. Yeah. Well, like, flipping, is a good one. flipping remade from Dust Till Dawn as a TV series. I think you, if you did do three, you should do the, the people under the stairs, Jordan Peele, but make it more, like, what It's we on put, here. She's got yeah, it written down. <laughs> yeah, she's like, calm down, Marsha. We have to make sure that gets represented. Marsha. It's really important. Yeah. Just, just go I'm on Sunday, it. and you can talk oh, about honey, it. Oh, honey, I'm, I'm going to be on an airplane. Oh, honey. Okay, you, oh, you, I I'll trust you. She got it. Oh, hush. Honey. She got All right. it. I got this. Well, that's, I think that's going to do it for now, then. Those are the three podcasts or, or oh, panels wow, that we're going to do. Well, was yeah, it, that was all three. Yeah. Was it amusing <laughs> hearing us fight it out? <laughs> So, we were fighting. We were discussing. Yeah, yeah why don't you guys let us know in the comments debate. down below what what movies, either emotional horror movies, did we miss, or what movies do you think would be primed for remakes? Maybe that'll help us decide on some of these. Oh, I got one. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Right in the eleventh hour. This is the only one. Tourist okay. trap. Tourist trap. Okay. Tourist trap. Have which I've, ne which I've never seen. Turistas was really good. Tourist trap. Tourist trap. It was the seventies. I will. I will, yeah. I will like to remake that. Cube would be another fun one. 
Oh, that's I'm a interested good, now. Yeah, that's a good choice. I yeah, I actually. Um, How about Jurassic it's, Park? It's, it's good. When was it made? Uh, remaking so, Jurassic not Park? Watching it. <laughs> like being sarcastic. Okay. Not doing it. Kind of All right. Well, we're gonna call it there, you guys. Yeah, Thank you very much for watching slash listening to this episode of the Horror Show podcast. I've been Cecil Laird. Grass is up and I'm Fuck out. I'm Susie Von Slaughter. Yeah, she is. Luis Hernandez. Marsha Parker is the, the best. best. And remember, <laughs> stay scared. I would be shocked if anyone paid attention to what was going on. Maybe.